well, it came through a matter of prayer. We, when Wesley Owen said that they needed to close, we felt that we needed to do something within the city, um, that literature was still able to be um, available, readily available. And uh, it, the Lord just laid it upon our hearts just to pray. Um, and then um, when Philip came forward and said, that uh, they'd been thinking that he was looking at a Bible uh, library van and we just felt this was the Lord just saying yeah go for it. Right now of course there's no outlet for Christian books in Carlisle and this is a great uh, possibility we can use it centrally on a regular basis and then take it around churches. I could also see it going into the rural areas where people don't have access to, to bookshops. Sorry. You have to get used to the move. Yes. <laughs> Feels like a ship uh, We had to do um, some basic cosmetic changes. Um, change the carpet, the interior, the shelving. Uh, we installed a uh, TV uh, so we could show DVDs. Uh, just make it a bit more warm and uh, inviting place to be really so very little changes really but it's uh, it's worked out quite well Hi, uh, it's amazing how things come together isn't it a vision within omnivision and then salvation army coming alongside and together this is the result and i'm i'm really impressed And the very fact that this is not going to be static, that it's mobile, it just means it's going to be open to so many people. And we just felt we just wanted to be part of that ministry. You know, it's great to buy online, but I personally would like to actually go and read the back of a few different books, see what it says on the back and flick through it, thumb through it. Lord, we believe beyond this city in the coming weeks and months. I think let's take literature to people just like Doulos, you know, the ship and so forth. I think you know, this is basically a ship, a ship on wheels, and when you go on board, it rocks just like a ship. So, yes. Oh, it's really exciting to see. I've heard so much about it, and um, it's really smart inside. And uh, Charlotte particularly liked the fact you had some low boxes and enjoyed looking at some of the kids' books, so that's a really good idea. And she also saw people out the window at the back, so that was, <laughs> that was a cool bonus too, so she certainly enjoyed it. The general public, those who don't know Christ as Saviour, they need to know that Christian literature is available. Um, and I just, it, it is very important. So I, I didn't see this, I thought it was going to be a shop or a church would come forward, but hey, this is what God wants. My, my vision is to have this vehicle out on the road every day into, yes, into Carlisle, but I'd like to see it down in the, the towns of Cumbria in the south of Scotland, an opportunity for people to come and buy good Christian books, but also to find out about Jesus. It's a brilliant vision, and I really look forward to seeing it being used for God locally and nationally.